Good afternoon, my name is Dayo Adelaja. I'm speaking to you from East Las Vegas Library, the newest library in the library system. Beautiful place, you guys gotta come to this place. Well, I have an art show titled Art and Form, a Cubist Artist Journey. Some of these work date back a couple of decades. Some of them I did this year. I decided to become an artist because that was what I was good at. I'm one of those kids that do dittos on books when, you know, doing math and doing, you know, some, I'm very kind of um, uh, concrete oriented, not even abstract. It took me a while to come out of my shell. So when I came out of my shell, I decided to work with forms. So what I'm doing here is really I put a grid, and the grid is my security blanket, by the way. You know how the kids take their security blanket and they walk around? That's mine. So this, this piece I did, and the idea was I wanted to learn colors. I want to master colors. And sometimes when you look at my painting, you have an idea of what color I'm working with. But I call this one green in the red major because mostly I'm working with red, but in that red, I have other colors. There's blue, there's green, there's purple, but only here you will see the color green. So I was thinking about like a symphony, you have the cymbal, and and so you bam! <laughs> That's all they did, you know. So that was what that was. This took me about three years, by the way, to paint. This piece is dedicated to blues. Because I listen to jazz, I listen to blues, I listen to all music, really. Church music, but I love the blues, you know. And to me, there are voices from the past, especially the old ones. Uh, these are the three giants, to me, of the blues uh, that we know today. Behind them you see banana leaves, or cocoa leaves. When I was growing up, I remember when you go into the farm sometimes, you see this plant have big leaves. So, I was reading a book where they said that B.B. Uh, King started, uh, when he was young, he worked on a farm. He was driving the tractors. So that got me thinking about the cocoa banana leaves. I was also working with color field, where you have big areas of colors. And you see how they interact, contour lines, how they interact with each other. But because I do, I'm into cubism, I still have to start breaking this into shapes. That's basically what this piece is, is in honor of the blues musician that I love to listen to. You will notice that I love to do pieces on other art form, like dancing, music, uh, opera, drama. And this one I did on violin. This is my second time of doing this after about maybe 15, 20 years interval. When I was doing this, you will notice that I didn't use, the, my grid was different. Even there's a grid in it, but you can see that I have different perspective where I blend the foreground and the background together. So it's kind of like flat, and you can see different angles. So the way I did this one is a little different from my normal way of thinking. This one deals with health. My mother-in-law had uh, Alzheimer's, you know, and uh, she was a patient at Luruvo in town here, brain center. And when I was taking her there, either for treatment or for counseling, I would look at the artwork on the wall, they're kind of different. So I thought I would do something about the brain. The whole piece is brain matter. The whole, everything is brain. But I went in and I put like curves and all kinds of stuff into it. And, and then I used my grid. You can see I, there's a grid, there's a system, like tiles in it. And then um, I tried to use like the, you know, positive, negative, because they say when you see things, you see things upside down. So there are a lot of things going on in your brain. So a lot of things I'm doing there, in fact, some people told me later 
that you saw another person in it. Even though there's really nobody in it. I only put this here so it would look like high and, you know, maybe cover a little bit to look like Ma, but there was nobody in it. It's about the brain. The name of the art show is Art and Form, A Cubist Journey. You are welcome to come and see the show. It's going to be on till September 20. Thank you.